Hello everyone, Robert Rambles here, and welcome back to World of Warcraft Official Hardcore and our Human Mage. We are heading back to Lock Modan today. I trained our level 14. Uh, we got Arcane Explosion, we got Rank 2 of Arcane Intellect, Rank 2 of Fire Blast, and Rank 3 of Frostbolt. I also worked on our tailoring a little bit, so we're up to 80 there. We're ready to start making bolts of woolen cloth, so I think I'm going to hold off on doing any more tailoring until we get a bunch of woolen cloth, which I, I might buy some. And then we can get a bunch of skill points on making the bolts. Uh, that was really all that I did besides empty out our inventory, so our inventory is pretty clean. And yeah, we're going to go after a couple of the lower level quests in Loch Modan today, and then we'll be headed into Westfall for a bit. Thank you guys very much for clicking on the video, for choosing to spend some of your time here with me in Azeroth. I really do appreciate it, and I hope you're all doing well. Welcome to Thelsamar, your home away from home in Loch Modan. Thelsamar is a nice place, but it's not all beer and salted meat for those who answer the call to duty. If you're willing to face danger in the name of the Alliance, then read the poster outside the Thelsamar branch of the Explorers League. We have a real infestation problem to the west. Tunnel rat kobolds have moved into the foothills, setting up dens and fouling our land with their filth. We want them eliminated. Hunt them. Bring me their ears and earn their bounty. You can find tunnel rat kobolds and their dens west of Thelsamar, littered along the mountainside. I hear Mountaineer Stormpike is looking for a runner. Someone to do a little travelling for him. How about it? Are you the person for the job? If so, then you'll find Stormpike at the top of the Northern Guard Tower. <laughs> There's never a shortage of empty bellies here in Thelzamar. Kids running in and out, workers from the excavation coming in after a hard day's work. We're famous for our blood sausages. I don't suppose you've ever tried them? No? Well, around here, you've got to work for your meals. And don't think just because you're a fancy adventurer, you'll be any exception. I'll need bear meat, boar intestines for the casings, and spider eye core for spice. You get me some of those and leave the cooking to Vidra. Alright, before we do too much more, let's go ahead and we will make some food and water. Uh, Iron Pan's excavation is a little bit of a higher level one. I think I'm going to leave that for now. Let's head to the north. We'll go after the different forms of wildlife, and then we'll be looking for tunnel rat ears.
usually I try to get the cobalt ears over on the western side of the zone, and uh, it doesn't usually work out. There usually aren't a lot of them. They're usually over farmed. Uh, working on them here over in the east seems to be a much better idea. I'm glad that we came this way. I don't know about tagging any of these guys. I feel like it's going to pull this whole camp if I do. Let's keep clearing the ones on the outskirts. A lot of chests in this area. This one we'll actually be able to get safely. And that is 12 out of 12. That might be the most efficiently I've ever gotten the cobalt ears. And now we're just after two bear meat and two spider ichor.
Let's go ahead and we'll turn in the breadcrumb here to Stormpike, but we're not going to do his follow-up. He has a quest that sends us into a cobalt mine to get supplies, and it's pretty dangerous in there. Like, in other modes of the game, we would go in there and, and I would have done the rat ear quest with his quest, but with it being hardcore, I think I'm going to avoid it for now. What can I give, honey? We'll empty the inventory out. Interest you on a pint? That's right. I have a task that I can't do while I'm guarding. In fact, it'll take you far from Loch Modan. Your perfect chance for adventure. There is a dwarven armor smith whose work I admire greatly. His name is Furin Longbeard, and his skill is unmatched. I need a new shield, and I must have one of his. The problem is, Furin is far to the south in the dwarven district within Stormwind, in human lands. I can't imagine why he would live there so far from Ironforge. The humans must pay him a king's ransom to keep him there. So if you want to travel and don't mind making some money, then will you send Furin my request for a shield? The silver stream mine to the east ran dry long ago. It was converted by the Miners League into a storage depot, but now kobolds have moved in, putting their filthy paws on good dwarven tools. We'll root out those vermin soon enough, but the League wants someone to get their gear out of the mine before we warriors tromp in there and break things. It'll be a tough delve. You might want cohorts at your side. The gear is stored in Miners League crates throughout the mine. Good luck. There we go, we are all done. Let's get back to town, we'll turn this stuff in, and then we're gonna hearth back to Goldshire because we are gonna head over to Westfall. Oh! 
How are you? Keep your feet on the ground. Ugh! When I asked for those ears, I didn't realize they'd smell so bad. Here's your reward, adventurer. Well done. How are you? Trust me, it seems a lot harder than it looks, but... Oh, I've never known someone to take much interest in the making of sausages, but I'll give you the recipe just in case. Here you go. Mind you eat them fresh. It was horrible. Verna woke me when she heard a ruckus in the fields. The fields were full of hooligans. We left in a rush, and I forgot to pack my pocket watch. Verna's PA gave me that watch on our wedding day, <laughs> and I feel just sick knowing those thieves have it. I left the pocket watch in the wardrobe at the farmhouse. Her Look personal for the assistant. Of pumpkins to the west. You can't miss it. If you bring it back to me, I'd sure be grateful. See you later. Hello. I never thought the day would come when I'd leave the farm, but the fields are overrun with thieves, and it's far too dangerous for us here now. As soon as Farmer Furlbrow gets the wagon fixed, we'll be on our way. Maybe you could do me a favor? Let me scribble down my recipe for Westfall stew. Please take it to Salma Saldin over on the farm yonder. The Saldin's farm is just beyond the fork in the road. Poor old Blanche. Such a tired beast after all the work we put her through. I fed her before we left the farm, but we weren't expecting the wagon to break on us. If you could bring her a few handfuls of oats from the fields, I'd be grateful. I bet you could find some around all of the farms in Westfall, if you can steer clear of those horrific machines that have taken over. 
There are several farms southwest of here. Times, huh, adventurer? No matter where you turn, someone needs help, and my wife and I are no exception. Look at what has happened to this place. These lands were once occupied by good farm folk, but the damn thieves have driven them all off. Not me, though, but it seems some harvest watchers have taken over the fields. If you're up for the work, I'd like you to go out and kill 20 of them. Come back when you're done for your pay. If you finish up with the ones in my fields, grab these clear really them quick. from the neighboring fields as well. Then we'll talk to, uh, Verna. Well met. Have a good one. That Verna was always such a sweet lass. We'll miss her here in Westfall. But between you and me, she's a city girl at heart, and Stormwind will suit her just fine. But enough gossip, now we can make Westfall stew. The onions are peeled. The garlic is minced. The rosemary is crushed. The crust has been baked. The dill weed is chopped. The gravy is simmering. Now all I need for my famous meat pie are eight Gortusk livers. Help where, me make some Westfall stew. Up? Come back with the following ingredients. Three stringy vulture meat, three gore tusk snouts, three murloc eyes, three okra. We just got two small hand blades in a row. Uh, is the game trying to tell us something?
Need help? Ah, so my friend sent you here? How kind. Well, the Stormwind Monarchy has abandoned our cause. Now it is up to the people's militia to keep the land free from corruption. If our cause interests you, I can put your combat skills to use in the name of freedom. The people's militia has but one goal, to defend the lands of Westfall and return peace to our surroundings. Unfortunately, the price of peace is often blood. One of my scouts has brought word of a band of Defias trappers wreaking havoc nearby. I have reports of Defias trapper sightings near the Jangle Load Mine to the northwest as well as at the Molson Farm and Thurlbrow's Pumpkin Farm. If you seek to join our ranks, slay 15 Defias trappers and 15 Defias smugglers and return to me. The band of wretches responsible for driving the good people of Westfall from the land call themselves the Defias Brotherhood. I need you to infiltrate this clan of thugs. We need to know who heads up the cartel and where they are hiding out. In Lakeshire, in the inn, there is a rogue by the name of Wiley who owes me a favor. Travel to Lakeshire in the Red Ridge Mountains, east of Elwyn, and find out what you can. Stormwind has abandoned us. A foul wind of depravity rustles through the plains of Westfall. This was my homeland, and I will not turn my back on the citizens who choose to remain here. We, the former farmers, shall make our stand. Your task, should you choose to accept, is to patrol the grasslands of Westfall. Track down and slay the vile gnolls that seem to be working in conjunction with the dead mines thieves. Bring me eight knoll paws, and I will reward your bravery. Although we don't get much aid from Stormwind directly, I do have a contact in the city who helps supply us with armor. His name is Osric Strang. His shop, Limited Immunity, is in the old town of Stormwind. Our supply of armor dwindles, and I must contact Osric for more. Can you take him this note? The fastest way to Stormwind is through Thor, our griffin master. He's just down the hill, bring him my note, and then take a griffin to Stormwind. You have to get this note to Stormwind? That's not a problem. You can take one of my griffins. For a small fee, you can take a griffin to Stormwind so you can deliver Lewis's note to Osric. You won't get there faster any other way. If that sounds acceptable, then just speak to me again when you're ready for the ride. I'll charge you a little, but trust me, it'll be worth it. The Defias front is constantly shifting. I've been following their movements for quite some time now. On a side note, I've ascertained that many members of the gang can be tracked by the red leather bandanas they wear. Bring me 15 of these bandanas and I'll see to it you are rewarded. All right, so I want to focus on finishing up the cooking quest. So Westfall Stew, 
and the gore tusk livers. I would like to get those done first.
Let's see if we can get into the house without having to aggro a bunch of guys. Sometimes other players will have cleared it out and it'll be relatively safe. Looks like somebody just came out of it. Uh, we've got two guys inside. Let's go ahead and we'll sheep one of them. Not exactly very smooth. person cannot be bothered to help us, but that's fair, we didn't really help them. It's a good time to level up after almost dying. There's probably no way we get in here without aggroing a bunch of guys. <laughs> that, yeah, that's the problem. And there's an elite vulture here who's coming right at us. That's that's not good at all. Uh, yep, he's a, he's an elite. He's got a skull. He's got a skull. I don't even know what that means. It means he's ten levels above us. Let, let's not mess with any of that right now. Let's let's peel out. Yeah, we don't we don't need the oats that badly. Let's see if we can go after some of the Murloc eyes.
And there we go. That's all the eyes that we need. Let's get out of here. This will be our last bag of oats, then we can turn both of these in right behind us. My watch. Thank you so much, kind lady. We are but poor farmers and we have lost our land, but please accept this reward as a token of our appreciation. Thank you so much, adventurer. Poor old Blanche will be so happy. All right, now we just need to find one more Gortusk liver and we will be all set. And of course, none of the boars in the area have livers. Why would they? Why would any of them have livers in the area? Thank you. 
that one had six items and one of them was not a liver. Okay, let's equip the green cloak. That's cool and everything. I, I would really just like to get the liver, but uh, we'll take what we can get, I guess. Getting a little bit crazy. You ever feel like the game knows like exactly the moment when you need a break and you're just trying to finish that one last quest and it just stops dropping the item. That's where I'm at right now. I was ready for a break like five minutes ago. <laughs> Which in hardcore like you never want to get to this point that I'm at. Like I pushed myself a little bit too long today. And I'm starting to get anxious to be able to get out of my seat and stand up, stretch my legs. And of course the fucking game knows this. And, and so, like, we've killed I don't know how many boars, and we just can't get this last item to drop. And if I continue to be impatient and rush, like, I'm gonna get myself killed. That, that's gonna happen. But, yeah, that's kind of the point I'm at. All right, yeah, that's it. We are not going to be able to finish it today. I do need to get up from my desk. I need to stretch my legs, get some water, refill my coffee, all that good stuff. So I'm not going to push myself to finish this one today like I want to do. I am going to go against what I want, and I'm going to do the safe thing, and I'm going to go park it at the inn so that we can stay alive. Thank you guys very much for joining me today. I really do appreciate it. If you're digging the series, leaving a like, ringing the bell, subbing to the channel if you're not already, all that stuff helps me out a lot, and I appreciate those that do. Until next time, take care of yourselves out there, and take care of each other, and we will see you back in Azeroth again very soon. Bye for now.